By definition, there are two different types of work holding fixtures employed by the systems to locate and retain the castings for machining. Robot end effector grippers and table mounted fixtures. Robot end effector tooling is simpler in design and more efficient for programming since the cutter tooling has only one tool center point for programming. The sacrifice is casting rigidity and vibration. The table mounted fixtures, equipped with both air and hydraulic clamping, minimize excess vibration and improve cutting speed and efficiency. The performance of the systems can be summarized as follows. Linear cutting speed during deflashing and chamfering, 4,500 millimeters per minute. Precision cutting rate at 2,000 millimeters per minute. The maximum SFM exceeds 5,000. The depth of cut ranges from 7 millimeter to 10 millimeter maximum. The three work cells operate in a 24-7 production environment that produces over 600,000 castings annually. The castings vary based upon vehicle model and comprise several different engine platforms. The duty cycle of the air turbine tools exceed 90% cutting time for certain cutting processes. Cost savings are derived from the reduction of touch labor that is normally required to finish castings of this type by conventional means. In addition to touch labor savings, substantial benefits are derived by the reduction of safety liability commonly associated with these types of highly repetitive machining tasks. The avoidance of carpal tunnel syndrome exposure and the elimination of cuts associated from sharp casting edges are viable benefits that add justification for this type of robotic automation. Process accountability is improved through the use of the robot mechanization. Processes that were historically qualitative in nature and difficult to measure are now digitized, allowing for continuous process improvement. This increased level of reliability and consistency greatly improves overall product quality without sacrificing throughput.